Hello, my friends. Nice to meet you again. This figure consists of 26 small triangles, and every four adjacent small triangles will form a slightly larger triangle. We try to put the four numbers 1, 2, 3, and 4 into each small triangle. And the four numbers in each larger triangle composed of four small triangles cannot be duplicated. Six of the positions have already been filled. Can you fill appropriate numbers in the remaining positions? Why not give a try, and we will come back soon. If there was no predetermined number, this problem would be easier, and there would be several ways to complete it. So the practical challenge is indeed how to deal with the limit by the predetermined numbers. If we try it too arbitrarily, it is likely that we will be limited in a certain position. For example, we start from the one on the top, just place two, three, four below it. Then, let's look here. There are already two and three in this triangle. And four in this triangle. So only one can be placed in this position. Next, let's look at here. There are 3 and 4 in this triangle. And there is already 2 in this triangle. So this position can only be arranged with 1 as well. In this case, 1 appears in this triangle for twice. Failed. Of course, one way to solve it is to try it in the opposite order, 4, 3, 2. However, when we face a question, we always expect to have a relatively clear idea in mind. How to find the idea for this question? Let's look at this hexagon composed of six small triangles. If in one of the triangles a number is filled, due to the limitation of the larger triangles, the other four small triangles can no longer be filled with the same number. However, the opposite position is not subject to any restrictions. Filling in the same number over there without affecting the given numbers would be a good strategy. In addition, we notice that, out of the six given numbers, the two fours and the two twos have been already in opposite positions. The other two, one and three, are not the same number. Therefore, the possibility that the same number cannot be filled in the opposite positions is relatively small. This does not mean that, this strategy will surely solve the problem, but it can reduce the number of arbitrary attempts. Anyways, let's try it now. We start from top to bottom, using one to fill the opposite triangle as many as possible. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Then from bottom to top, use 3 to fill in the opposite triangles as many as possible. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Then fill in 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. At last, fill in 2 to the rest. Now let's check. Large triangle facing up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Large triangle facing down. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. No problem. Perfect. Today, we successfully completed the task of no duplicated numbers in the large triangle. But how about if we require the four numbers on a line cannot be duplicated? How can we consider such a problem? We will discuss it next week. Thank you for watching. And see you next time.